Oh, here we go. The slow down, ho down begins again. Stomp your brakes and don't you go. Make everyone behind you move real slow. It's the slow down, ho down. Yeehaw. Howdy, folks. This is the beef ripener. <laughs> uh, man, I'm never gonna let myself lift that down. But yes, this is the beast rider. And, uh, I'm riding, although not too quickly. Mostly because traffic is scared of itself. Meh, what are you gonna do? I'm not gonna let anything harsh my mellow. I'm just happy-go-lucky. Yes, I am. So, I'm feeling kind of ridiculous today. Don't know why, I'm just feeling kind of ridiculous. Not incredibly hyper or, or anything like that, just... Uh, just feel like blabbing. Nothing in particular either. It's just more of a hey, I'm out here. Yada yada yada. Wee. It's that kind of feeling. Any hoozle. I've just been wondering, have you guys ever had that mood? You know the mood where you're just I don't know, goofy. Ah, uh, that's what was slowing everything down. Somebody got pulled over, so now everybody's like, Oh my gosh, it could be me. I said, slow down. Either that or they had to turn around and look and go, Ooh. That's annoying. It's really annoying. And I think in one of my earliest videos, before I was even, you know, riding and making videos, I think I was sitting in my living room and I said, you know, Rubbernecking is just idiotic. Something happens on the side of the road and it doesn't directly affect you. Move. Get out of the way. Nobody behind you wants to sit there and wait and wait and wait for you to see what's going on, and the people next to you to see what's going on, and the people next to you to see what's going on. Because you didn't want to sit there and wait for the people in front of you who had to see what was going on. So just get the hell out of the way. Drive. Just go. Because you're creating traffic congestion. And you're contributing to a problem. 
that not only pisses off everybody else, but most certainly pisses you off too. So why the hell would you do it? You freaking retarded, as they say in Brooklyn. Anyway, as I was saying before, uh, you ever get in that mood where you just feel goofy? I'm goofy. I'm always goofy, but every once in a while I feel extra goofy. I, I keep my goof to myself a lot of times because I, I don't want to scare people. That would just be wrong. <laughs> Yeah, those extra goofy feelings sometimes just you are kind of fantastic, you know? You start giggling to yourself for no reason and then you find it hard to stop. I do that. And then when you can finally get, actually get words out, people are like, what the hell were you laughing about? And you're like, I don't know! I don't know! So what do you do when you get into those extra goofy moods, if you do? And do you get into them? That's my question. Do you get into extra goofy moods from time to time, and what do you do when they come up, when they happen? Alrighty folks, this is Beast Rider. I'm going to uh, pay attention to traffic, so uh, you guys ride safe. Stay classy. Hi, little lady. I really got to be.